Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Sorry this video is a day late. I uh, waited as long as I could last night for the new update to happen, but it just didn't happen, didn't happen, didn't happen. I finally had to go to bed because I had to work today. But it was just a half a day today and I am done. So let's go ahead and check it out, see what's new. Huh, okay. Well, it is Friday. But there is no new update. That is last week's. The added sellable with cereal. The one-way stairs. Alright, well. I guess there doesn't have to be an update every week. I think it says in the description of the game that there's an update every Thursday. But I guess it doesn't have to be. Uh, okay, well. Let's go ahead and just take a look at my store. Here are the cereal boxes from last week. <clears throat> One thing I did notice after I made my video was the corn bursts say now no ants, <laughs> which made me laugh when I saw it because you. <laughs> All right. So uh, the work I've been doing on my store, let me just run around, take a look, make sure everything's looking okay. The work I've been doing on my store um, in between waiting for updates and things uh, is mostly just adding storage. Storage is always an issue. I'm going to pull up the box here and show you. Uh, well, now that I've added storage, but pretty much all of the time my storage was constantly full and it was just always a hassle to buy new stuff. Uh, I'm going ahead and purchasing stuff I notice I'm low on while I'm talking. Uh, anyhow, um, it was just a constant struggle to keep enough storage space um, for everything. So I am adding more storage, and I will show you that in a second. As long as I'm in here, let me just go ahead and buy a few more things all right jewelry jewelry is so expensive it's hard to keep up on that let's go ahead and buy 10. all right so my delivery driver is going to go and pick up that stuff all right so out around the back of my store is where i am adding the storage. I started it uh, earlier in the week and I did a little bit on it last night when I was checking in to see about updates. So this area back here, I uh, bought the land behind my store, all of the plots <clears throat> along here for uh, three thousand dollars each spot you can see because now they're now they have the grid that means it belongs to me i did not buy these two here uh, but i went ahead and expanded my storage i just added uh, i haven't put any flooring down yet it looks like i did because it's snowy right now but i have not i did put a little bit of roof over the the shelves I put down but I guess I'm going to make this whole area storage I have this area here it's my little test area oops nope I don't want to buy land but it's my little test area for the new walls and doors and windows and things that came out eventually I'll get rid of those but I like having them here so I can reference them when I need them the different types of things all right, let's go ahead and exit that. It won't let me scroll back out. Yeah, I don't want to be in that close. All right, so that's what I was working on while I was waiting for the update. And now that we know there is no update, yeah, I guess I'll keep working on it. Go ahead and put some... Cement 
down, concrete, I guess it is. And I may expand the uh, storage for up above too. But not right now because I just don't need that much storage. Eventually I will as new product gets added and as I expand my store. Then I need more storage. Actually, I might make up there if we if he adds new, the developer he or she if they add um, some like whole new department, like the lumber that was recently added or the garden item, something that that deserves its own section. I may turn it into that instead, depending on what it is, or move some stuff around. Um, to make it work for whatever. If I need to move something that's downstairs, upstairs, so that I have room downstairs, whatever. Uh, so I may do that. Right now, roofing tiles will work to cover. You can't... If, you, if I put walls up up there and stuff, um, nobody will walk. Um, none of my employees and none of my customers will walk on roofing tiles, so I would have to switch it out to an actual flooring for that section if I use it for something else. But for now, roofing tiles are the cheapest option. They're only $10 each, so I'll go ahead and just uh, cover this area with roofing tiles till I need to switch it out. I'll get credit for the roofing tile when I switch. So, like if I choose a $40 item, I will get $10 credit for the $10 roofing tile and the flooring tile will only then technically cost me $30. Do I have, I can't quite get a view. I can't tell if I have flooring under all of those, but all right. So there's flooring. Let's go ahead and put our shelves down. The storage shelves are not under the regular shelves, they're under the, um, the infrastructure area. And we're going to turn that so that it's facing that way. Put it right up against the wall and see if I can fit two in there. Yep, but then nobody can get through to the other row. So I'll go ahead and put that there, reverse it so I can, oh, come on, so I can put it against the wall here. There's already something there. I must not have put this one far enough over, so I'll move this one over. Did not mean to spin it. All right, now there should be room. Okay. <clears throat> and I may put a door. I don't necessarily need a door going outside. I can probably get away with putting two shelves against the wall. So I'll go ahead and move that over one and then go ahead and sneak one in there. Okay. So let's take a look at how much my storage has expanded. So it was 30,000 previously. Now it's 33,500. And let's see, we've sold all the kitchenware. So we'll go ahead that. Toys. We'll go ahead and buy more of those now that we have room to store it. All right. So that lets customers still, they can still access the lumber yard 
from the back of the store or the front of the store. This way. And I'll go ahead and put roofing tiles. Did anyone else notice? So recently they changed the sign so that you can actually read it. So it's not blinding. Did anyone notice that the stripes, like these crosswalk stripes and the um, parking lot stripes, they seem to glow now? Am I crazy? Am I the only one that sees that? Anyhow, I noticed that the other day and I was like, did it do that before? I can't remember. All right, let's go ahead and just put some ceiling tiles down and then we'll... Call it good because there's obviously no update this week, which is fine. Under no obligation to us. Move up a floor. No, I do not want to buy this plot. I want to put... Oh, I accidentally changed it to shingles. Or for the metal roof. I don't know why. Shingles seem less durable. I know it's a game, but it is what it is. Metal roof just seems safer. All right, so we'll put some roofing over those shelves. Not worry about the part that doesn't have um, anything there yet. We'll worry about that when I decide what I'm doing with it, if any new updates happen next week or something. Oops, have a little trouble manipulating this today. All right, and then we'll do some real quick lighting. I'm going to move back down for lighting. And I use just the generic fluorescent. And then we'll check now my decoration. I'm sure these um, symbols here along the side, you can check your decoration is because up here next to the money my decoration was five stars it has fallen to four stars because i added this section with no decoration so i'm going to go ahead and add in plants because plants are the cheapest quickest easiest way to add decoration to an area that you don't really need to do much with so anyway back to the thing you can see it's red Whereas over here it's green. You want green. So we're going to go ahead and put some plants. And just do a double row since we have a double wide aisle. Oops, it doesn't want to move. And you can see it's turning green underneath areas that are really utilitarian like with these shelves um, those will definitely uh, mess with your decorating score so just hang in some plants turns it green uh, I don't know why it's red here maybe we'll just do some up this row because we do have Quite a block of shells with no real aisle in between and over here is just kind of neutral because i don't have any um utilitarian shelves or anything there and when you put down security measures like your security cameras and things those take away from your decoration so you have to balance that kind of thing all right we will call that good okay well I will probably see you later in the week um, for some of my other videos. What the heck is up with my pants? I look like I've got shorts on or blue boots with purple band up over my knee. I'm going to have to go into my, my uh, profile and see what's up with that because that is weird. Uh, anyway, it's hopefully just a glitch that I didn't accidentally, maybe the pants I was wearing are no longer available or something. So I'm in my boxers. All right. Anyway, you guys have a great day. Thanks for joining me. 
And I'll be back to check for new updates next week. Bye!